Hello everyone! In Rome, it's just another Thursday afternoon. I worked this morning, I went to the gym, I'll work later. But for my American husband, this is not a normal day. Today is Thanksgiving! Woo! If you're not Italian, maybe you don't know, maybe you do, but in Italy, we don't celebrate Thanksgiving. Like, at all. Halloween is not our holiday, but usually you can still find something out there for Halloween. Like, people do things. Well, that doesn't happen for Thanksgiving. So it's really just a normal day. And I know that it's a big holiday in America, so tonight I made a reservation at an American restaurant and I'm taking my baby boy to eat some American Thanksgiving food. But for now, I just want to ask him a few questions. Okay, to talk about Thanksgiving in Italy, I need a special American guest. So, Brian, please take a seat. Hey! Thank you for joining me today. You are not welcome. <laughs> just kidding. I wrote down a few questions that I want to ask you. Today is Thanksgiving, right? In America. Yes. But it's not in Italy, right? Happy Thanksgiving. Question number one is, how do you feel about the fact that we don't do anything for Thanksgiving in Italy? I don't have any strong emotions or feelings about it. I just think it happens to be an American holiday and it's not an Italian holiday and that's that. So, sorry for the terrible really? answer. Yeah. You don't miss the holiday in America? That's a different question. Is that the next question? Well, how do you feel about it? I just feel like it's one less day for people to be like celebrating. Like right now, if we were in America, everyone would probably be like, ooh, 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 ooh. But since we're not in America, everyone's just like, it's another day. Yeah. Is it dark? Add that light, beesh. Oh my god, I'm like a ghost. But whatever. Question number two is, what do Americans do on Thanksgiving usually? Well, it starts maybe in the early afternoon, 2 p.m. People start coming over to the house. There's some football games on and people watch that. And then like maybe 4 p.m. you start eating and like there's a pretty big meal for Italian standards. It's not even that big. And then <laughs> after that, like the sun starts going down and sometimes like the gentlemen of the family go outside on the street and play a football game. And then like you come back inside and you eat a dessert like some pie or something. You play football on the street. Yeah, not tackle, just like touch. After that, you eat dinner or yeah, you eat the cake like the pie, and then people start leaving at like 10 p.m. and then you go to sleep. But question number three is: If this is what you usually do on Thanksgiving, what have you done today so far? Today <laughs> I've worked a little bit, chilled a little bit, I ate lunch. I ate breakfast, that's it. A little different. Yeah. Question number four is... I like these questions. What dishes do you expect to find on the menu tonight? Is it a Thanksgiving place? Well, it's a Thanksgiving dinner. It's a nut. I highly place. expect turkey, because that's the prime time meal. Okay. I expect potatoes, probably mashed potatoes, and I suspect some vegetables, corn, pumpkin pie. Corn? Like yeah. you eat, just eat corn. Corn on the cob. Okay, so you have turkey, you have mashed potatoes, and you have like corn, mm -hmm. and then? Pumpkin pie, those are, that's what I'm expecting. Uh, and pasta, because it's Italian. All right, all right. I'll actually ask you more questions after the dinner. Hi. So this is part one of the interview, but then there will be a part two. But since it's Thanksgiving, um, what are you thankful for? You, your family, and my family being healthy and having a good life. Just everything. Seems like a lot to be thankful for. <laughs> Thank you and I'll see you later. I want more questions. Later, after the dinner, okay? <clears throat> later, baby. Bye. Thank you. Okay, we're ready to go. We're about to leave. And the balloons are in Brian's honor. America! Let's go. Are you hungry? Yes. You have to give an honest review. I'll be very critical. We started eating pretty late. It was like 
10 p.m. But oh well, at least we were hungry because the menu was big. It was not too expensive, 35 euros each, and it had a starter, a main course, side dishes, and a dessert. First, Brian ordered these crostini. Well, it doesn't sound American, but the ingredients are American because it had cream cheese and uh, like a cranberry jam. I don't remember. I tried it a little bit, not the bacon part because it had bacon and it was really good, the jam. It was like salty and spicy. I ordered a pumpkin soup with almonds and little pieces of a bagel. It was delicious. And here we have our famous turkey with some weird American filling like chestnuts and cranberries, I don't know. And all the side dishes like there was a casserole with mushrooms and green beans. There were baked potatoes and some sweet like honey carrots that I didn't really enjoy. Like the only thing I didn't really like, but it was really good. Instead of the turkey, I had rice with apple, nuts, mushrooms and cranberries. Pretty good! And then of course we were full but we wanted to eat the famous pumpkin pie with whipped cream and cinnamon. I don't know, it was just so creamy. And it's next day, it's not Thanksgiving anymore, so it's not a holiday. It's Thanksgiving. What do you mean? Thanksgiving, Thanksgiving. Ha 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 ha. Okay, <laughs> can I ask you a few more questions? No. All right. It Is was fun, bye bye. Obviously, how was the dinner? Really? Yeah, it's pretty good. What was your favorite dish? The first thing I got, the crostini. Was that typical? No. At all? The ingredients could be considered typical, but the actual dish itself, no. And how about the rest of the menu? Was that typical? Was that what you were expecting? That was pretty typical. Had it been a meal in America, like I wouldn't have been like, what is this? I would have been like, yeah, this is this. Even the taste? Like yeah. the taste of turkey and... As far as I know, yeah, it's pretty accurate. But I mean, he's not a food expert actually. Exactly. I, it could be completely different. I wouldn't really even know. My tongue's not too articulate. I only have one question for you. How was your Italian Thanksgiving? It was very good. Really? I appreciated it. Sonia san was very nice and giving. I didn't play football yeah. with him. <clears throat> the, worst the, part, <clears throat> the worst part was no football. Sorry. I did my best, but please. Uh, jokes aside, like every year I try to organize a little something for Thanksgiving because I get super depressed because I'm not in America during Thanksgiving. You don't get super depressed, but maybe I would get super depressed if I were American. So I'm like, if I lived in America, I would want you to do something for January 6th, a Bifana. I like that holiday. I've just taken notes. Thank you. Thank you for being here. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you soon. Thank you for watching. Bye.